Hey, it's Saturday, time for pizza and computer games. Um, I've read a bit about this quest that's annoying me, that's kind of stuck. Where is it? It's a, it was about this painting um, that was stolen and I had to find it back. Then decided not to tell the countess who had stolen it. This was an option. Now it's stuck. Uh, I've told the countess that neither suspect is the criminal and that the painting must be in the possession of someone outside the castle walls. She seemed disappointed, but I've kept Chanel's honor intact. So, I want to get rid of this out of my list, and I read a bit. Apparently, you can talk to Chanel, and she'll paint you a portrait and notify you of this within three weeks. Well, this has been... This is very long ago. Although, according to this, we're still in the same year. Right? Third era, 434. Third era, 434. I mean, this is like a hundred episodes ago or something. 26th of Morning Star. Second seed. I have no idea. I mean, I don't know that much about uh, <clears throat> Elder Scrolls lore to actually know the, the months of the year and all that. Um, anyway, I'm going to try and talk to her. It, sorry, <clears throat> I don't remember if I did or not. I don't think I ever got a message. But yeah, I'm going to give that one more try. We're waiting for um, a grey fox anyway. To uh, also send us a message. Yeah, he could call for me at any time, I should wait. In the Imperial City if I want them to find me quickly. Well. Yeah. Whatever about that. Um, so this was in. I think it was in. Coral. Castle Coral. Available now on itch.io and Steam Early Access, Taxi Nut is an open world space sim where you play a lonesome taxi pilot looking for a missing friend. Currently featuring over 50 hours of story content and over 200 different planets, caves and stations ready for you to explore. To become a Taxi Nut today, hop on over to itch.io or Steam and get yourself a pilot's license. Me? Might not even be easy to find her. You smell of death. Conjuring up dead things. Yeah, this is the right castle. Oh, I'm probably not supposed to be here. Yeah, there's a room. Oh. Supposed to be in here. Um, I thought I was a hundred percent chameleon. Yep, I don't know how you can see me, you Mr. Magic Script. Weird, he's not here anyway. I think this is her room. This is your sure. last warning. Get out or I'll arrest you. They arrest me then. You get out. Yeah, here's the paint stuff. She's not here. Yep, yep.
Nah. Nope. Weird. I don't know where she's gone. Maybe that was what happened the last time as well. Oh. Um. I mean, when I ended the quest, I probably went looking for her and couldn't find her. That rings a bell. The hell is she then? Oh, now the countess is gone too. Maybe if I wait in there. In her room. Pretty sure that's her room. Stop! You violated the Ah. Uh, no. Then pay with your blood. Oh. Yeah. Where are you? Yeah. I'm gone. Oh, I can't wait now. These idiots have been aggroed. Yeah. And I have a bounty probably again. Eh? <laughs> How do I get out of here this? Stupid place. Uh, what? How does this work again? Not here. Private quarters. Tower. Uh, great hall. Right. Cards are so fucking annoying, honestly. I wish they made them permanent, you know, NPCs. Once they're dead, they're dead. You could just kill them all. Oh, that's her. <laughs> hey. Words cannot do justice for the joy I feel. Many blessings upon you, my friend. I do not have much, but I wish to reward <laughs> such valor. Return to me in three weeks, and I'll have a special painting for you. It is the least I can do for you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Great. Until our paths cross again, my friend. Yeah, I'm out of here. That is fantastic. And I'll be rid of that. I don't know. It pleases me to no end to clear a quest list. This stupid list. What does it say now? Yeah. You'll have to wait three weeks now for this to... And then probably go back to her or something. Anyway. We also have... Um, this, oh yeah, this will never get rid of, I'd say. This, this is for the Brotherhood. I must return to the sanctuary and speak with Vicente Valtieri to receive my reward. Did my best there on the pronunciation. Valtieri. I can only speak in a cheesy Italian accent. Um. Where is that then? I can't fast travel at the moment anyway. Sorry. Are you all gone? Yeah, I've decided to give up. Um where was this in Shaden Hall? Oh yeah, I better check where I have a bounty now. No I think I do because I think I see a guy running for me already. Well uh, why do I see this again? Hell? 
Oh, here, wait. Five gold. For that, I'll have to go to jail and all that. Well, they'll bring me to the... Although, they might not be so aggressive. Turn this on. Just in case. Where is it again? Weird entrance. Oh yeah. Uh, eh? Oh, it's in here? I don't have a key to it. Wait, what? Was it this house? Oh, yeah. What the hell? Oh, they gave me a fright. Those are moths. I hate moths. Just a little piece of paper. <laughs> Stuck to my bottle. I lifted it up and it like fluttered. That was like a moth or something. Um, what do I do here? Oh yeah. I hate butterflies as well. I don't like them. So is it true about your latest contract? The girl's nanny was actually a fighter's guild bodyguard? Me, was it you? So you heard. So, the pirate has been eliminated. Excellent. No one will mourn his passing, and Sithis has been appeased. Uh, you're Please accept a this black band as your reward. It is a ring whose powers are quite useful to those who value discretion. Thanks, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Oh, okay. What the? Dark Guardian. Um, what is this ring? Thou speakest of it. Black band. Hmm, resist magic 18%. Yeah. <laughs> no. It's cute. I hope they don't require me to wear it. So I can get a new quest, I guess. I'm glad you've returned. The contract is waiting, if you're ready. Yep, always ready. This. Um, well, just give me the contract. We need you to stage an accident. Kill the target in the manner specified, and you'll receive a considerable bonus. Do you accept this contract? Yes. As I expected. Good. The target is a wood elf named Bainlin. You will find him at his home in Bruma. Enter secretly and avoid his manservant, Grom. On the second floor is a secret door leading to a crawl space. Inside are the fastenings of a mounted head that hangs over Bainlin's favourite chair. Loosen those fastenings any night between 8pm and 11pm and the head will surely fall on Bainlin as he relaxes in his chair, as is his custom. If Bainlin is eliminated in any other manner, or if the manservant Grom is killed, you will forfeit the bonus. Now go. And may Sithis be with you. Um, I wasn't paying attention. What's the bonus? This. Oh, this just back out. Okay. Um. Right. Rumor. Um, what did he say? Between 11 and... hope it says it here. It doesn't. Uh-oh. 
how... Well, after 11 anyway. I hope they don't mean 11 in the morning. Second floor crawl space. Painland. No. Here. Oh, it's for sale. Painland. Bayman's house, I can access the second floor crawl space and loosen the fastenings on the mounted head between 8 p.m. Oh, and 11 p.m. It will fall on Bayman as he rests in his chair. If Bayman dies any other way or if Krom is killed, I will lose my bonus. Okay, so that's the chair. It's too late now. Uh, between 8 and 11. Right. We better get out of here then. I'm gonna just wait here. Kinda stupid. 8 p.m. That's a long time away. Oh fuck it. Wait. Uh let's say uh 17 hours. So it's now slightly after eight. So what do I owe this pleasure? You're not there yet. Basement, no. Second floor. Where do I enter the crawl space? Here? this hmm. then this this after eight right yeah okay these appear to be fastenings of the mounted minotaur head as expected they have been loosened over time sorry you could easily remove the fastenings causing the mounted head to crash to the floor below do you wish to remove it yeah. immediately I don't think he was sitting there <laughs> was he <laughs> I'm the worst is this him it is <laughs> he's sleeping p.m. right it's set between 8 and 11 p.m. he's asleep Fuck, I don't know what the bonus is. Can I put it back? <laughs> On Morrowind. How the fuck? Between. If I can access the second one, uh, I loosen. Here, loosen the fastenings. Between 8 and 11. Yeah, okay. I should just wait until he sat there, but... Fuck it. But I reload it. Reload it.
Right, Benman. Go sit down there. He's asleep though. That must be Grom. Yes. Um. We'll go out for a sec. And wait. Like an hour. Maybe he's sitting down now. Is the old codger. It looks dead already. One more time. Between 8 p.m. Yes, and 11 p.m. Well, that's very soon. Can't rest for an hour. Come up. What was that? Like a green mist or something. Like a magic effect. And then? Weird. Do I have to be in place or something? Is it AM? Wait an hour or whatever. It's good to see you again. I have a message <laughs> for you from the Grey Fox. Oh, he just managed to track me in this house. Okay, what is it? The Grey Fox has a task for you. Meet him at Melintus Ancus' house in Coral. <laughs> right. And you joined the Thieves' Guild? Yes, I did. After you saved me in Castle Skingrad, I vowed to join. I was having no luck on my own. Um. Now I am running errands for the oh, Grey Fox yes. himself. Now I remember. I owe you much for your help. Right. Bye. May shadow hide you. Oh, where's the green arrow? There. Why? Am I supposed to do something here? Or that's because he's up. Oh yeah, that's because on the other floor. Well, he's not coming down. It's past 11 now. Um, 
Right. We'll wait out here in the snow for like 10 hours. Stop right there, criminal scum. Does he ever get up? This guy is broken. I think your boss is dead. <laughs> NPCs are kind of up and about around 10. At him? You see the shadow through the. It's probably Chrome. No, he's up. The fool is up. You have a nerve root there as well. Like that. Go on, go sit in your chair. Guess he needs his coffee. Um I have to wait outside. An hour? Seven hours, say. Or do we have to be there before it or something? Just going back to bed. Oh, there he is. Oh, yeah. Time to die. Oh, that sounds good. The mounted head has fallen on Bainlin, killing him as expected. I must return to the sanctuary and speak with Vincente Valtieri to receive my reward. Okay. Let's have a look at the man. Oh, you'd expect uh, to be worse, but okay. Do you have anything interesting on him? This key? Gold. He didn't even notice Rom. The chest upstairs as well, wasn't there? Beggar prince. Green silk garment. Oh, here it is. Okay. That's not much. Okay.
Him. Why is it red? The arrow. Oh, he's in a different quarters. Is it you? Like a dark gift from the Night Mother herself. Thanks. So, the accident has been staged and Banelin lies dead. Well done. You have more than earned your reward and bonus. I present to you this dagger. It's an enchanted blade known as Sufferthorn. Its prick is deadly, I assure you. Yes, you are quite an asset to this sanctuary. In fact, I believe you are ready for advancement. I hereby appoint you Slayer. Well done. Now go, child of Sithis. Go and rest. You'll need it. I suppose, like with most of these, this is real cool if you do this when you're lower level. At the moment. Oh, what's uh, Suffertorn? It might suit me though. Suffertorn. Um, it's like not even half of my blade's damage, but range strength and damage held 35 points. Hmm, okay. Maybe it's sort of good. We'll keep that. We... Oh, we just went from green to red, the marker. Oh, he left. Right, he left the area. Like a dark gift from the Night Mother herself. Thanks. Please, tell me how I can help. Back for more? It just so happens I have another contract available, one that requires an expert in infiltration. Hmm. Okay. As always, you fail to disappoint me. Your target is a dark elf named Valen Dreth. He thinks he's safe in prison. He is tragically mistaken. A prisoner recently escaped from the prison using a set of secret tunnels connected to the Imperial City's sewer system. It's a perfect way inside. Just outside the Imperial prison is a grating that leads to the sewers. It has recently been tightly locked, but I will provide a key. It should be easy enough to locate Dreth in his small cell. Besides, I think you know the way, hmm? <laughs> Valen Dreth has been imprisoned for many years. His tongue is sharp, but his body is limp and frail. He will prove an easy, pleasurable kill. You will receive a bonus if you fulfill the contract without killing any of the prison guards. Now go, and may the Night Mother go with you. Pleasurable kill. When I kill, I kill for queen and country. Um, oh, it's of course the tunnel, I guess, that I came out of at the beginning of the game. Is it? Yeah, it is. Oh, that's cool. We're going back there. So, I don't know, will I do that first, or... We go to uh, the Grey Fox. Ah, the Grey Fox can wait. I actually think I'll enjoy this more. Oh, I have to get out of here first. Well, that's been a while. That's how it all started. I call again Vilverin. Vilverin, yeah. <laughs> right. Um, do it like this.
Well, that's a bit darker than I remembered it. I have entered the sewers beneath the Imperial prison. I must now proceed through the sewers and into the prison itself and kill uh, Valen Red. Right. Let that go again. Oh, the map is gone. Remember this. to go through the ah. I do through the field I think this is different though than when we came out of this I don't remember it being like this. Which is okay. Oh yeah, this... I've never seen this. Shadow. That's it. I'm not disagreeing with you, believe me. Those assassins got what they wanted. The Emperor is dead. They That's exactly what I'm saying. But will the captain listen? No. Is that him? Assassin. This one is dead or oh that's another assassin who tried. Mythic Dawn ropes. Okay. This What's this knife. No. Nothing important. Um. <laughs> All right. So this sort of like. Who's there? Oh, nobody. Just those rats. I think I remember this from the beginning. Then we went right. Yeah. They're on to me now, though. Got my spell. Sorcery. I 
This is the amount, the amount of guards that they should have had when we uh, were here with the king. Now, now they're guarding a prisoner. Uh, well, I guess. This is dark. Okay. Sorry. I'll have to go blue. Wouldn't be damn rats. Oops. They were just done with me and then I fucked it up. Is this also from the beginning? Yeah, this is the hole I went into. Oh yeah, and then up here, go to my front. Yeah, this is the cell where you start. Uh, that's cool. Ah, sorry, I have the. What is it? The night vision on. Seven, eight years. We've had a good long run, you and me. Always must have been the someday. Ah, he's gone. Good. Uh, what will I use? This will do. Can we talk to him? Wait! I, I know you. You, you're the one. The, the day the Emperor was killed. They went through your cell. You lucky bastard. But you came back? <laughs> Come on. You've got to help me. Let old Valen out of this cell. You've got your freedom. Now give me mine. What do you say, huh? Come on, friend. Uh, no. The Night Mother says goodbye. The Night Mother? No, no. Guards, guards, help me. Somebody help. Assassin. Well, don't start running. Oh, he's dead already. Valen Threat is dead and no guards have been killed. I must return to the sanctuary. Speak with Vincenti Valtieri to receive my reward. Ah. Just to like a dead. Well, he won't have anything on him now. Take this stuff. I think they're kind of unusual or something. I remember reading. Oh. The fuck? Um. Wait. Don't tell me I have to go all the way back. Oh. These might do the trick. Thanks. Oh, and then you're just here. We could have gone in that way, of course. Right. Well, that's that. Friend Valtier is going to be pleased. Um. Yeah, these would be nice more in the beginning or to do or halfway through your playthrough. Um. Is that you? Huh? 
he sleeps. He's a vampire though. So, you infiltrated the Imperial prison, eliminated Vale and Dreth, and killed not one guard. Most excellent. In addition to your standard reward, I present to you this bonus. Behold, the scales of pitiless justice. While carried, the scales will magically enhance your strength, intelligence, and agility, but diminish your personality. A powerful tool indeed. Alrighty. What is that kind of armor? Scales? Okay. Did I not get it or something? Kind of. Oh, it's just a thing. It doesn't say anything about effects. Wait, um, stop then again. Right. Doesn't say it there. Uh, where do I see that again? By strength? I'm saying strength, right? Well, he said agility as well, anyway. Oh, here. Sort of separate, weird. Ability, strength, agility, intelligence plus two. Oh, but I can't get rid of it. Oh, it's an ability. Sorry. I can cast it. Right? Eh. Uh... No, I don't fucking know. Is it permanent? Oh, it's not called ability, it's called greater powers, okay. I don't know, it's probably just on there and just a little bit odd right i've heard oh. so much about you yeah welcome to our family okay family i'll take my other quest while i'm here actually but we're going to continue with the gray fox now i have a special contract that needs fulfillment in truth i don't wish to offer it to any other family member i've come to rely on your abilities Okay, what is it? We're usually called upon to take a life, but not this time. This contract requires us to stage the assassination of a marked man. Are you ready? Uh, yeah. You must go to the city of Coral and break into the house of Francois Mottiere. Inside you will find Mottiere waiting for you. Do not kill him. You see, Francois Mottiere is a marked man. He owes a considerable sum to the wrong kind of people, so they have sent an enforcer to kill him. Here, 
you will use this specially poisoned knife to stage Mottieri's death in the Enforcer's presence. Mottieri himself will provide more details. This is an unusual contract. Mottieri had to make a special arrangement with us before it was approved. I trust in your professionalism. Okay. Anything else about the poison knife? The blade has been coated with a rare poison called Langerwine. One drop in a normal human bloodstream will mimic the effects of death immediately. I have provided you with a vial of antidote, which will be used to revive Francois Mottieri after you successfully stage his death. You should also know that there's only enough Langer wine on the blade for this one contract. After Mottieri is sliced, the knife will be useless. <laughs> okay. Don't worry. What's the special arrangement he has? The Dark Brotherhood is not in the business of staging deaths, no matter how much gold is offered. Sithis demands blood, and blood must be paid. In order to accept the contract, we demanded a life. Mottieri offered his mother, and we accepted. Lucien has already taken care of that uh, detail. Okay. Right, I won't ask about the other stuff. But what does he say about this? A cure? Yes. Yes, I believe it's possible. A mage named Raminus Polus has done some research. He's in the Imperial City at the Arcane University. Yeah, I know the guy. Oh no. I don't need it though, I'm not a vampire. Don't give me a quest. It's... Spill some blood. I don't know. Yep. No, I don't wish to. Not for me, dear brother. I want to clear that list. I can do it very simply at my house anyway, or so what's it called? You. Deep Scorn Hollow. Right. I guess you can probably do more in here. You talk to the others, but at this point. I'm more in the mind of just finishing the game. Right. What time is it? Yeah, it's uh, 54 minutes, so... Um, next time we'll go to the Grey Fox. We'll continue the Thieves Guild quest. I think. So, see you then, maybe. Bye.